Good evening everybody, buenas noches, and welcome to another video, alright? Today we're going to be looking at how to crop our loops. So I have this sample loaded up, a WAV file that I threw in Recycle, and it sounds like this. Alright, Sweet Loop, awesome, but I only want the first couple bars, I only want the drums, alright, so what are we going to do? Check it out. We need to crop it. The first thing that I do is I'll listen to it and kind of get a feel for what I want. Cool, so I, I want it until the beat drops. I'm going to just click drag my right cursor process crop loop all right now i have something that's a little more a little easier to manage but it's still not what we want check it out now you can hear you can hear it looping it's got no rhythm it's just not tight right so that you need to identify the starting and stopping point of your loop. Bass loop, drum loop, rap loop. You want it to be in time, all right? So that way you can loop it, chop it up, and manipulate it. But you still want it to have some rhythm, right? To have it swing, to have its thing. You don't want to take away from that. All right, there's two ways to do this. The first thing you're going to need to do is you're going to need to count. You're going to need to know how long it is. So we're going to count this one out, all right? One, two, three, four. First hit's here, last hit is here. Two bars, okay? Now we can either go up to pencil and draw these in manually. We also have this sensitivity bar right here. Let's see if we click and drag to the right. You'll see that it's gonna to start to paint these pencils in, all right? So let's keep drawing. Now we have one right on our last hit. When that one draws in, we drag, click, and drag the right on top of that pencil. Let's keep drawing. And there it is. All right, now what's cool about this is our loop is cropped. If you want, you can drag your sensitivity all the way to zero and just have your loop again. Let's hit the space bar and double check or hit play and double check that it's tight, okay? Sounds good to me, man. You can hear the bass come in, boom, boom, boom. Now, yeah, that's gonna, you're gonna have to mess with that after you chop it up, you're gonna have to play with that, but it's in time. That's our ultimate goal here. So we're gonna process, crop again. And we have a, go up here, two bar loop, enter, and it'll even tell us our BPM. Now make sure you go to preview to save your tempo, right? To save your BPM. There's a lot of other things you can do here. You know, we'll get into these in later tutorials. But for right now, I just wanted to show you how to have a nice, tight, cropped loop. All right. There it is, right? Bam. That's sweet. whatever you want with that you know you have your drums bear it with drums play a bass line over it filter the bongos out you can do whatever you want but it's in time all right i hope you found this tutorial helpful and until next time konnichiwa hasta luego <laughs> muy bien